Hey everybody, it's Shelly and I have a nifty little tool on Facebook to be able to share your screen when you broadcast on Facebook Live. And if you're not doing any live video streaming using Facebook Live or maybe you plan to, just know that you can now go in and show your screen. What that means is when you're live, have a good internet connection and make sure you're in airplane mode so if someone calls you, you won't be knocked off. When you are creating your live broadcast, you'll see at the right at the bottom, share screen. Before you go live, you're gonna share your screen. Keeping in mind that you can toggle back and forth. Now, if you wanna practice on your personal page, select only me. Now, you can't do this on your business page or a group, but on your personal page, you can do only me and you can practice all day long. A Couple other things I wanna point out. Once you do go live and you do share your screen, you'll see three tabs here, your entire screen, application window, or Chrome tab. You usually you want to go to your application window. So in my case, I might be showing this PowerPoint if I want to share my screen. When you are sharing your screen, keep in mind you are not on the screen at all. So you can always stop sharing your screen. You'll see at the very bottom, stop sharing screen, and then you'll pop up. Now, unfortunately, I can't take you onto Facebook and show you this live because I have one camera that I'm using. I guess I could have done it on my phone and and gone that route, but the bottom line is here I am on Facebook Live. I am not broadcasting. The minute that I start trying to share um, a broadcast, uh, it won't work because I'm using the camera with screencast omatic That's what I use. But you'll notice here, um, right up here, I'm sharing with only me versus my friends so nobody would see it. And I'll sh I'm going to actually show you what happens when I do this. If I do share, excuse me, share screen, there's my entire screen, or I can go to the application window and say, just show my PowerPoint, which is what I'm on right now. Um, just show my reminders. Whatever it is, I can click share. And when I do that, you'll see I go away and it's kind of hard to say, well, where am I here? Well, I'm actually in my presentation we're looking at, but at the very bottom, it says Facebook screen sharing, sharing a window. You click stop sharing and then you will come back on um, live as you see me right here. Um, now I can't go live. I'll show you what happens when I do. It'll basically say we can't use your camera. Oh, now it's letting me. How interesting. Three, two, one. We are broadcasting live, but this is only to me, so I'm not really going to worry about it. But I wanted to show you how to do that and show your screen. So you have to select it before you get started. I can't go back now and say I want to do that. Um, notice there's that only me, and I'm going to end broadcast because I just wanted to show you how to do this. Oh, the first time I did it, it wouldn't let me broadcast and show my screen when I was using Screencast-O-Matic. But I think you get the general idea. Uh, very cool because it's free. If you're like me, I've been using GoToMeeting and it's expensive. If you want some public training because it's affordable, go to ShellyRoth.com. You'll see my Facebook class, LinkedIn class coming up, and my Gender 101. I'm doing diversity and inclusion training now. Or just shoot me an email if you want to connect and get some private training or speaking for your company. Have a great weekend and we'll see you next time.